Hey guys, one of the questions we get asked all the time is how can we track the success of our SEO efforts? So today I'm going to take you through a few ways you can review your SEO performance using Google Analytics. Whether you manage it in-house or whether you outsource it to an agency, you can follow this process. So stay tuned. First, of course, you're going to want to head over to your Google Analytics account. Once you've loaded the page, you can go over to Audience and click on Overview. This view here will give you some very top level information that will become quite useful for you moving forward. So for example, the first thing we need to do if we're just looking at SEO traffic or organic traffic is to filter out all the other different types of traffic like direct, uh, any paid traffic you may have or any referrals and whatnot. So first thing you want to do is go up here, click on all users, unselect this all users bit here, scroll down and click on this little button next to organic traffic. This will then pull up a view and show you your organic traffic you've had over, let's say from the 1st of March of this year, 2019 to the, uh, the last day of March, 2019. And as we can see here, that accounts for 44.95% of their traffic. Now, if I wanna get a general overview of how my traffic's been performing in the past, you know, however many months, if it's an upward curve or not, I can just click this over here. I can then click this 31st of March down here, which is the date of when I'm recording this. And then let's just say I wanna see the last six months or so, so I'll click on August and click apply. This then will give you a very top level overview of your traffic over the past six or seven months or so. What we can do then is we can now change the way in which we view this. So over six months looking at the days, isn't that relevant? So we can look at the week view or we can look at the month view. And we can see here nicely that this website's traffic from an organic perspective is going up, which is great. And that's what you wanna see. Now, there's a problem with looking at month on month traffic. A lot of people like doing this. However, we normally say that it isn't the best sort of view or outcome of, of what's going on because there could be seasonal trends. There could be a dip over Christmas, for example, like we can see here. Um, so what we like to do is we'd rather look year on year. If we come over here, and click again on March 31st and March the 1st. We can then click on compare. And rather than going previous period, we go previous year and you click apply. This will then show how your SEO performance has been from a year on year basis. And again, some of the classic ones to look at for new users, you can see that it's a 51% increase in new users from 1,197 last year to 1,800 odd this year. Again, with sessions, the session duration has slightly gone down, which could be something to look at, which should be something to do with potentially looking at heat maps and user experience, which I'll do another video on. But overall, it looks quite healthy from a year on year perspective. What happens if my traffic isn't up and to the right and it's going down month on month? How do I dig deeper? And this is a report that we're going to go into now. So if you go across on your left hand side to behavior in analytics and then click on site content and click on landing page, you'll be shown a view similar to this one. Now, what this view shows you is all the traffic through organic search that has landed on a particular page. Now, why you want this report rather than all pages is all pages may show you some popular pages that people have traveled to from once they've already landed on your website. So they may come through to your homepage and then a popular page might be one of your product pages. What this report is and what we're interested in seeing is the pages that people have found your website through from search engines. So for example, someone's landed exactly on this product page, hasn't found it within your website, but it's found it through a search engine page. And that's how we know they're ranking well and are gathering traffic and users in search engines. So if your traffic is going down, this is a great report to see and identify the problem. So as we can see here, we're comparing year on year. And for this product page, which I've blurred out, sorry about that. But for this product page we've done here, we had 364, no, 356, sorry visits this uh, this year in March versus 14 last year. So we can already see that this is an improvement and this page has higher visibility in search engines because it's getting more traffic. Now this one, the product page below it is slightly down 
We had 284 versus 340 last year. This one may need a bit more, you know, TLC um, to sort of get it back up um, to where it was. And maybe it's slipped a couple of ranks, so it's not getting as much traffic. But really simply, what you can do is use this report to identify where the holes are in your strategy and whereabouts you're you know, losing traffic that you used to have. We see it all the time where clients write about seasonal trends. So for a couple of months, they get a big boost in traffic, a big peak. Then it sort of drops right back down again a couple of months later. Um, so you really want to go in here and identify whether it's just some of your blog posts, which are gaining less traffic, which are, are the lower intent pages, or you know more crucially, whether your higher intent pages, which are your product pages, aren't gathering as much traffic, which can then sort of go on to directly impact the amount of leads that you have in a short term basis on the short term basis. So this is a great report that if everything's not going your way from a search engine standpoint and you're getting less organic traffic, you can go and dig into this report and find out exactly which pages um, aren't performing as well. And then you can then go and actually create a campaigns off the back of it to uh, therefore go and boost your traffic.